New 2017 Mercedes E-Class Coupe Revealed in Detroit Mercedes Stylish E-Class Coupe takes bow at Detroit and starts from £40,135 with first deliveries commencing in April. Mercedes has officially revealed the latest addition to its coupe range in the form of the brand new E-Class Coupe at the Detroit Motor Show. Detroit was the setting for the E-Class Saloon's introduction last year, and while we received official pictures and specifications of the new S-Class Coupe-inspired two-door E-Class towards the end of 2016, its presence on the stands at the North American International Auto Show, NAS, marks the car's public debut, and we have exclusive images from the show floor. Prices for the new E-Class Coupe will kick off at £40,135 in the UK, rising to £50,775 for the flagship model. First deliveries are set to take place in April. Only the AMG line trim variant is offered in the UK, for now at least. The £40,135 price gets you the 191BHP E220D diesel AMG line, while a further £890 is required for the 240BHP E400 petrol. For now, the range topper is the 328BHP E400 for MATIC at £50,775. The E-Class Coupe's design is heavily inspired by its smaller C-Class and larger S-Class siblings. The rear end, in particular, has familiar stretched tail lamps and the same rakish roofline, while everything from the A-pillar back is bespoke to the two-door. Naturally, pillarless doors and LED lights all round complete the upmarket appearance. The E-Class Coupe is 123mm longer and 74mm wider than its predecessor, although despite the roofline it's also 32mm higher. The wheelbase is also extended by 113mm, which Mercedes claims improves leg, head, and shoulder space significantly for example, there's 74mm of additional rear legroom on offer, which should impress your passengers. The E-Class Coupe's interior, as we expected, echoes the saloons, with two optional high-res 12.3-inch screens that create a floating widescreen instrument and infotainment display. AMG line models, as well as offering bigger wheels and a body kit, brings along sportier cabin details and a revised leather-wrapped wheel. The coupe also carries over the same raft of connected services and autonomous safety systems you'll find in the saloon. At market launch, the E-Class Coupe will be available with one diesel and three petrol variants a different strategy to the saloon. The sole oil burner for now is the E220D, with the familiar 2.0-liter four-cylinder unit producing 191 bhp and 400 nm of torque. It manages 0 to 62 miles per hour in 7.4 seconds and goes on to a top speed of 150 miles per hour. Combined fuel economy is claimed at 71 mpg, while it emits 106 g slash km of CO2. The entry-level engine is the 2.0-liter four-cylinder E200, however that isn't being offered in the UK for now. A more powerful version of the same engine, dubbed E300 will be available to buy here. It produces 240 bhp and 370 nm of torque, Goes goes from 0 to 62 miles per hour in 6.4 seconds and tops out at 155 miles per hour. Mercedes claims 44 mpg combined and CO2 emissions of 147 g slash km. For now, the flagship variant is the E4004 MATIC. With a 3.0 liter V6 producing 328 bhp and 480 nm of torque, plus four wheel drive, it fires from 0 to 62 miles per hour in 5.3 seconds, and is limited to 155 miles per hour. Claimed consumption is 3.5 mpg and CO2 is measured at 183 g slash km. An AMG Lite E43 should soon follow with 396 bhp, while it won't be too long before a full fat 604 bhp V8 is dropped in to create the E63 AMG Coupe. All models come with Merck's 9-speed automatic gearbox as standard.
the suspension has been revised over the saloons, too, with the standard springs sitting 15 mm lower and with a comfort-oriented tuning. The optional 3-mode dynamic body control suspension is also lower, while air body control air suspension is also available. All E-Class coupes feature a wider track, 67 mm at the front, 68 mm at the rear, which is aimed at improving handling for the two-door.